Hey, what is up everybody? I'm Star Lord, and today we're gonna be doing another Pokemon Brick Bronze video. It's actually a video of confirmed news, I guess, for Pokemon Brick Bronze for the new 8th gym update. It's gonna be absolutely amazing, guys, and uh, yeah, this is hopefully your first look at this kind of stuff. Um, anyway, before we get into the video, guys, don't forget to leave a like, and also, I will have a video on this tomorrow, more explaining it. Uh, probably Nathan will actually be in the video, too, so if you definitely want to see Nathan, then, uh, after a little while then yeah uh, make sure to click on the subscribe and turn on notifications so that you don't miss it um, but a little while ago actually around about like an hour ago I think it was now on Twitter uh, Lando actually tweeted out another little bit of a leak of Pokemon Brick Bronze and um, yeah it was pretty decent actually it was a pretty decent little leak it was actually an image of a new Pokeball coming to Pokemon Brick Bronze now I know a couple of you guys were probably thinking oh okay it's a new Pokeball I mean what, what yeah that's pretty cool right well actually this Pokeball says a lot more about the new upcoming update uh, than we think so on screen right now is the actual tweet itself and it says PBB leaks I made the image Thumbnail ready to save YouTubers time. You're welcome. And he's just kind of going off that like a lot of YouTubers do clickbait and all that kind of stuff. Well, yeah. People do. It's the way it is now on YouTube. Um, but basically, as you can see, in the middle right here is a new Pokeball, and a lot of people actually thought that it would be a Pokeball to celebrate Veterans Day. Um, obviously, an American uh, kind of thing. Um, Personally, I don't think it is. This kind of looks very similar to the Pokeball uh, that you would use in the Safari Zones. And uh, what's really weird is that a couple of months ago, or a couple of weeks ago, I actually did a video saying, you know, I would love to see a Safari Zone added into Pokemon Brick Bronze. I gave a load of, like, reasons why it would be good. And I'm just kind of hoping right now that Lando saw that video and was like, wow, this dude's kind of making sense here. I mean, we can make money off it. People will love it anyway. Um, and yeah, I just thought it was really cool. So if you guys missed missed my video on the Pokemon Brick Bronze Safari Zone, make sure to go and check it out. It's in the description right now, and that will hopefully give you guys an insight to what Lanzo saw, and maybe he worked on it, or maybe he implemented some of the things that I asked him to do. Um, but basically, if we go down right here, a lot more people actually agree with me on the whole, you know, Pokeball thing. So, uh, King S Gaming here said, let's make clickbait. I don't think so. Army Pokeball, I guess the next map is settled in World War One. Sinai Desert, maybe, with Arceus as the general. He's just kidding there, I guess. And then he goes on to say, I know it's a Safari Ball, or is it? And then I Am Murderface says, Not enough arrows or unreleased legends in the thumbnail. I thought that too. Um, and then, yeah, Foey said the exact same. Uh, but then Warm Connell, actually, he's a pretty cool guy. He's a really cool YouTuber. Um, he actually said, um, We are coming. And he actually added in a GIF of Kangaskhan Mega Evolution. And uh, these are the kind of things that are probably going to be added. It's going to be like Lickitung, uh, Kangaskhan. Um, I, is Chansey in the game yet? I, I can't even remember. Is Chansey in the game? I, I can't remember. I haven't been in the PBB game for so long. Um, but basically, we can probably uh, probably count on them to add a lot of Pokemon into, uh, you know, the Safari Zone. And then, obviously, one special Pokemon into the Safari Zone, too. Maybe, like, a Legend or something like that. Maybe, like, uh, Meloetta or something. I'm thinking Meloetta would be a pretty good one to add into the Safari Zone. Like, you know, you hear this music when you're running around. It's, like, kind of nice, joyful music. And then it turns out... It's it's not like actually the speakers around the Safari Zone, it's actually Meloetta singing because it's so happy of being in this area with all these happy animals because, you know, these people who run the Safari Zone look after the animals very, very nicely. That would be pretty cool, actually. That would be a really nice kind of um, storyline to go into it if they was going to add in a mythical Pokemon. Um, but anyway, guys, I would like to see what you guys think in the comment section below. What Pokemons? Give me your five top Pokemons you would like to see added into the actual update itself if they do add in a Safari zone. My number one Pokemon is definitely Kangaskhan. I cannot wait for that Pokemon. OP as heck. Um, but anyway guys, thank you very much for watching today's video. Remember, I've got one tomorrow with Nathan discussing the whole PBB thing and uh, yeah, just have a very awesome night. Until next time, I've been Star Lord. Oh, see ya!